dang, that was quick. 30 minutes after that or whatever, 30, 45 minutes, he had it done and was walking back out to put it back on my truck. I said, man, that's bad. But he does them all the time, too. That's really? kind. You know, it's easy for him. But, you know, Linda's doing selfies. True, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> but Linda's yeah, not doing that. selfies. Ma maintenance. Linda's doing easy. mod shots. There we go. Hell yeah. That maintenance stuff will get you. That's why I'd rather have an American made. I told him the whole time, I said, I won't ever buy anything foreign. I said, the next thing that I really, really want to get, Tyler, and he says, what? He says, he's a Ford man, big time. I'm just an American-made man, and I love Ford, too. And I said, the next truck I'm going to get, if I get another truck, it's going to be an F-150. It's going to be a 2014 F-150, but I'm going to have to wait a few years because I want that solid aluminum F-150 that just came out. Yeah, that's my big redneck buddy I've known for over 10 years. That's where we have our bonfires at. Uh... My hubby, of course, the dog thought he was a lap scratcher. Um, I want one in Ford F-152. I've been hollering for one for years. And then gas went up. And of course, trucks were out of the question. But, you know, I want a truck with a sign on the back that says, Silly Boys, Trucks are for Girls. Because my second vehicle, no. Yeah, my second vehicle was a Ford truck, like a 70s model, that was manual gears on the steering wheel. That's how old it was. Love that truck. Threw a rod in the son of a bitch. Hated that. But love my truck. You know, you can haul anything in a truck. That truck is the one that got me into trouble with the big boy from Shoney's. That's another story for another day because I'm not sure when the statute of limitations runs out on that. They still may be looking for us. Anyway, that's just a short clip of my life in the Redneckville. Later.